riding high Can't nobody hold me down I'm doing whatever now Ain't got no time to fight I'm talking way too loud And if you don't like the sound You could just tune it out Welcome back to the channel. My name is Mosumola. If you're new here, you're welcome. I hope you enjoyed this. And if you're my OGs, like my forever queen that is always coming here or king, you're very much welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by again. I am a beauty and fashion um, enthusiast. I love lifestyle. I love all the good things of life. I believe we deserve it as children of God. I would not say it's been a while I did a haul. I mean, I've been buying, but for some reason, I haven't just been showing them on camera. But today, I said, okay, I got some things off Zara, and you know, I just thought to share them. I mean, these items are just very casual items, nothing, you know, extravagant or anything. If I like them, I'll keep them. If I don't, I'll definitely, you know, be sending them back. And please don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like this video. Yeah, so let's go. I just love to go outside and see package. It just gives me so much joy. It elevates my mood instantly. And I'm sure it does that to you as well. I think the bust area might not really size me. So, I mean, of course, I'm definitely going to wear it so you can kind of have an idea of what it looks like on my body but this is a jean dress and this is what it looks like i saw it on the model and i just thought it really looked nice guys zara models are the absolute worst to give you an inspiration for clothing one tip that i'm going to talk about is when you're shopping in zara please look beyond their models like just picture whatever outfit that you see that you kind of think that you like just picture that outfit on your body and then it can kind of give you an idea of what it would look like by the time you style it okay. there's so many zara hauls or zara videos that can kind of like give you an idea of what a particular item you know is or you can always be stopped on my page because I'm an adding Zara shoppers. Do what works for you. I really don't know how they measure their sizing or how it is that they work with their sizing. But I know that for a tall person, honestly, I might not necessarily recommend Zara. Especially when it comes to pants because their pants really fit more into the 5, 3, inches thereabouts some of their models are like 5 11 right however most times they are not on heels especially when they're wearing pants so you want to also keep that in mind as well i'm kind of like gravitating into like washed denims i don't want like the deep deep blue denim i kind of feel that with this um wash kind of gives like a neutral tone where you can you know accessorize with different things you know or with colors and again when i was buying this particular item i wanted it to be not necessarily snug but i didn't want it to be big because i kind of like have like a particular fit in my head with this so even if the chest area even if i have to like wear like a camisole inside i really don't mind but i didn't want it to be free or i didn't want to buy a large i mean i got this for 69 dollars guys i know it can be annoying with zara denims sometimes it can be unnecessarily pricey but honestly for the quality that you're going to be getting from it i think it is worth it like this but i've just discovered a hack guys while wearing this outfit and i think you should see it like this is very very difficult to pull in i'm loving this hack so what i did was i took like a headband i put it right here right like this put it put the other hand in the next hole and just drag it guys can you see how this is like magic <laughs> this is magic can you see can you see although i'm not going to be buttoning this so it doesn't even matter but that was such a cool hack guys you see what you get to learn on this channel so and the other item is this cardigan like guys i really really love this cardigan this is what this cardigan is giving it has like stones how beautiful this cardigan is it is so cute it is a knitted top and it has like love stones in red and in silver guys i can imagine how i'm gonna rock this i feel it is so cute like this kind of top just gives you like this girly girly look this is in a large and i got this for 49 dollars with this one for some reason i'm not even liking it as much as i am liking it while holding it but it's still just something that can be you know i mean i don't know <laughs> what do you guys think but i think i might keep it i might keep it but it's kind of looking like i've return it but because you just never know with these kind of tops what do you guys think do you think i should keep it do you, do you like it like i don't know 
I'm kind of very indifferent with this, honestly. This one is the waistcoat. To be honest, I thought this was black, but I think this is giving blue. This is giving navy blue, so I might have to return this because I wanted it in black. I have like, oh my god, I didn't think this was gonna. I mean, I like it. I like the color, but the color that I was expecting was black, so more than likely, I'm going to be sending this back. I didn't know waistcoats are in vogue now, like short waistcoats, like they are so in vogue, and I'm so so loving it I really can't wait to rock it I mean even though this is blue this is not necessarily the color that I want but I'm definitely going to get the black um, if I really like this I might as well keep it because again um, you want colors in your wardrobe and the other item is this off shoulder top guys this is like a knitted top as well it's like cardigan but when I saw it I think I saw it on some girls video and I kind of like just fell in love with it One top it is very off shoulder from the picture that I saw in the model it's this is a multi versatile top. I like it. You could do a warm shoulder with this top. You could also put it like this. I don't know. It just gives that nice. If you don't want to do the off shoulder vibe, you could just like freestyle this, right? You could even like put it like a very like sheer one hand like not so much of a one hand but like it's just giving like like some sort of ruffled elevated girly i don't know what word i'm trying to look for but i know you understand what i'm trying to say the design is really more off shoulder but i think i just like the versatility of this top but look at that waist it is snatching guys the price point for this one was 47 90. and this my friend is a pleated skirt first of all this is looking very big i got this in a large and i'm not even sure why i got this in a large this is very very big i know why sometimes that i buy my skirt in a large because i just want it to give me that extra fullness of pleats the quality is a very very soft material i'm not really sure for 45 90 i'm not sure i would want to like keep this i would probably return this again because i mean the quality is not bad but for me it is very soft so all of this other pleated skirts that I have from Zara they are thick like if you feel the skirt they are so thick and very heavy this is not heavy at all what it's giving me I'm not sure but in my mind I was going to actually pair this top with this skirt like that is where my mindset had been going you know with this with this top and this skirt but again I'm, I'm definitely going to wear this so you guys will see what i'm talking about all right guys another item that i got is this knitwear i think this has to be my favorite from this haul and it's not even valentine no i don't know why all of a sudden i'm just picking studded like love shapes but again i really really liked it i think it's picture worthy i think it's weather worthy i think it's fashion worthy like i think it's all the worthiness that this can bring you can style this in a very very corporate light you can style it social you can style it in a chic style like this you can casualize this it can be professionally looking it can be you know all weather all joy price point for this was 49.90 essentially 50 dollars and this is the last clothing item that i got in this haul i know this is like a dupe of the Kodgaia purse but I have been eyeing like this purse and also I have been wanting like a very simple gold purse and I just kind of felt like it was just good to have this to be honest. It's not like like I don't know but I just felt it was just good to have you know something simple when you want to you know go to a party. I don't know how I'm going to pull this open. What happened? Ah. That was very hard to open. I mean, I don't know, maybe because it was my first time. But this is what the inside looks like. My phone can actually go inside. And I'm sure maybe like cards and, you know, very, very tiny things. I probably would not stock this up, you know, with a lot of items. But again, because of the metallic um, design, it also kind of feels like you don't even need to put a lot. Just something that's very simple. Maybe like your lip gloss, your powder puff, or your powder, or your phone, you know. And then you're good to go. But this is really, really cute. I, I don't know how much the Kogaya one is. Maybe like 200 and something or 300 and something. But this, I think I got this for $59.90. Um, uh, pretty much $60. So I think this is really, really this is really, 
really good. And also guys, I bought this bag. Guys, I've been gravitating into small bags. I kind of feel that with small bags, it just gives you all small box bags, you know, that have very small handles, not necessarily like a long strap. It has a long strap, but I think what really caught my attention to this um, is this handle. It's kind of very spacious. You can put so much inside this bag and then you can kind of have like the box fit in this. But when it comes to bags, I'm really, really building my bag rack. Um, I kind of feel like buying of clothes but i don't buy bags to complement them so i'm going to be doing a lot of bag haul this year in fact most of the things that i'm going to be buying this year will be accessories bags shoes i, I have a lot of clothes but bags um i think i, I need to do that so it, it's not giving so much of a high quality leather but it's just giving something um that can pull up an outfit you know simple elevated whatever however you want to you know define elevated um this can you know go well with it but i think this is not bad i think it's actually a dupe for one designer i can't remember the name of that designer now but it is a dupe for it if you know zara you know zara does like elevated elevated dupes what is a big baby girl without having a body or like you want to go out and you want to be glistening i've heard so many great things about this body oil okay like i can like use my last call to buy body oils because again you just want to like go out and just give that healthy glow vibe let me see initial thought i would think um it was something that i could spray but it kind of has has like just like a whole kind of you know um opening ah it smells like a perfume that i used to have it's very light oil um that has like glitters let me put it on my neck uh at least my neck will kind of show i don't know what this is giving i mean it's just giving like oil yeah but if i'm looking at it i kind of see like the glitters you know tiny 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 glitters but is it very moisturizing? I think it is. It has a very good smell, guys. Oh, I love, love, love the smell. For anything, if you're going out, if you can just pop this up, even if you forgot like your perfume, just put this in your bag because it would definitely come in handy. Even if the oil doesn't come in handy, the smell will definitely come in handy. It's a very, very light oil, so I don't know how long lasting this might be, but you probably want to reapply this. It is very, very light. But if you give anybody a hug, like they'll just want to be licking you like this. <laughs> they just want to be licking you because this smells so good. Smell. These are all of the items that I got guys. I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did Let me know the ones that you like. I really enjoyed filming this. Please give this video a thumbs up Please give it a share. If you are going to this place, I don't know why you don't just want to subscribe to this channel It is free. Subscribe to this channel and let us make this channel grow. I'm going to see you on my next one Have a beautiful rest of the week. Bye